What's going on? It's Ferg here, and today we are reviewing second in form Stefan Kiesling. He is a striker from Bayern Leverkusen in the Bundesliga and has 76 pace, 83 shots, and 84 heading. And standing at 6 foot 3, that is a deadly combination. Um, so, yeah, he's got pace, he's got shot, and he's got heading. Um, and I also picked him up for around 17.5k. Uh, this was about, I think, Saturday I picked him up, the Saturday after he came out in the Team of the Week. So 17.5k is surprisingly cheap for for his, you know, uh, his card. Anyway, moving on to his stats. Yep, there you can see I've got him in a 4-4-1-1, and he currently has a red card because I completely decked someone. <laughs> I don't know why, it was a bit of a stupid thing to do. But yeah, um... You know, not bad passing, not bad dribbling. Um, I mean, his passing says 71 on the card, but it's awful in game. Like, don't don't buy him if you want to pass with him. He's he's a very bad passer with the ball, but his dribbling's all right, uh, and his pace with mixed with his height is very good. Um, basically, what you want him for is his shot and his heading. Uh, he's six foot three, as I've said, and he can definitely get his head on the end of a ball. So uh, that's always good. Um, and yeah. I'll just skip into some uh, in-game stats. You're right, guys. We are back with the informed Stefan Kiesling. These are his in-game stats, and as you can see, this is just all the information you probably already know. Uh, six foot three, 176 pounds from Germany, and he can play apparently striker, centre forward, centre attacking mid, and right wing, which I'm not too sure about. But yeah, he's got a high attacking work rate and a high defensive work rate, uh, making him quite the you know, handful for the opponent, but the problem with his defensive work rate is that he does get back quite a lot. Plays a bit of a Wayne Rooney kind of role, kind of all over the pitch, just running around. I mean, I've seen him countless amount of times just defending for me, which is not always what I want him to be doing, but, you know, it, it, because he's got a high attacking work rate, it's fine. He'll stay up there. Uh, Three-star weak foot, three-star skills. Always have to have three-star skills on a striker, preferably four, but because it's three-star, you know, you can work with it. And the weak foot, not really a problem. I've scored a couple of goals with his left foot. But, you know, anyway, uh, on to the next page. His physical attributes are pretty good. His acceleration is not the best, but his sprint speed is actually really good. So when he gets going, uh, for how this, his size, he will actually be pretty fast. Uh, his balance is very poor, though. He does get knocked over quite a lot. Uh, but I'm sure you can get around that as long as you just look at the 82 strength he has, which is pretty good. So uh, his reactions are 95, which is obviously the standout stat in the, on this page. Uh, and yeah, basically if the ball's being cleared or something, he'll he'll uh, grab it out of the air and he'll run along with it and score. You know, uh, I think there's one goal in the clips to come that he actually does that. Uh, he gets the ball off David Luiz, runs forward a bit, and just not knocks it in the bottom right. So yeah, onto the next page. The mental attributes. He's got 86 aggression, which is pretty good because he's always chasing down the ball. He's always making sure that he's, you know, contesting for it. And uh, his attacking position is 80, which is pretty good. And for his size, you know, he needs he needs good um, attacking positioning to make sure that he's in the right place at the right time. Uh, onto his skill attributes. His ball control is pretty poor, but you don't really kind of expect that from the uh, Bayern bulldog. But um, yeah, his crossing is pretty bad. Uh, you know, 93 finishing, 90 heading accuracy, 88 long shots. That's just what you got to look at on this page. I mean, that's a stunning, stunning overall stats um, for a striker. I mean, 93 finishing, he's not going to miss if he's one-on-one. -on -one. Keeper doesn't have a chance. Um, heading accuracy is just unreal. He gets, if he gets his head on it, you know, it's in the goal, no problem. Uh, the long shots are very good as well. Uh, you'll see the final clip is actually a very nice long shot um so yeah uh very good long shots if you want to try those out penalties 84 pretty standard for a striker uh and 92 shot power which is really really nice also 90 volleys um but 92 shot power yeah he does have a very very powerful shot uh and it's quite a lot of the time very accurate as well so you know he's definitely a player uh that loves a bit of a long shot and then we're back to the original page. So, yeah, I'm going to play some clips, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this squad builder. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and peace.